Hello Libras, this is your reading for December. Before I start, I want to remind you guys that this is a general reading and it may not apply to everyone. So if you resonate with this reading, then I'm glad I could help. But if you don't resonate with this reading, then it's okay. Maybe in my next video I'll have a message for you. Or maybe if you're interested, we can do a private reading. Um, on Skype or WhatsApp, wherever it's more convenient for you. And it's basically 25 euros for about 30 minutes. So, okay, that being said, let's get on. I will be using this new deck of cards that I just got from La Scarabelle. I really love these cards and I also love the back. I like that that is black. I don't I'm not so crazy about the print here, but I love that they're black. Okay, let's see what we have for you, Libras. May whoever needs to hear a message the most. I hope that the cards have some meaningful insights for you guys. Libras. December. Okay. The main issue. Your card. The outside. And two. And the last one. Okay. So, the main issue, oh, we have the Five of Wands. Here, this. Um, your card, oh, <laughs> the Knave of Swords. Okay. Is this Knave? Naked and Eve of Swords with like, uh, seem like fake boobs. <laughs> All right, um, coming from the outside, we have the Empress, the not the Empress, the High Priestess, or the inner voice in Osho deck. Here's the High Priestess sitting on her throne. With a beautiful moon on her back. The blue theme. Okay. Uh, what you need to do, we have the Empress. I love this Empress. She's so beautiful. Right? With her crown. In these trees. This, this theme of trees with like fires instead of leaves grapes and her scepter and she has on her belly there it is like a bird and bees here see bees and flowers and <clears throat> wearing her crown Okay, and the last card, <clears throat> we have the Judgment, the final Judgment rising up from the graves, time is up. Okay, um, so you're in some sort of a conflict with someone. Um, <clears throat> and you're being pissed about it. This knave of wands, very like schmug <laughs> here and you're kind of, um, you feel like I am right, they're wrong, you're very, like this has a, an attitude, see with her. <clears throat> head raised like she's convinced that she's right <clears throat> she has this attitude 
that is not quite a healthy attitude in my opinion when you're so convinced that you are right and they are wrong and uh, they, this person, or maybe whoever you're dealing with we have the inner voices, like they're they're not necessarily wronging they're not doing okay, I'll do some more cards to get some more clarification for this, but the thing is that judgment will come justice will be done and what you need to do be more compassionate and be more understanding this is the the Empress is the mother card which she, she, the mother is understanding, is tolerant, has patience, has compassion you know, when her child does something silly, she doesn't get angry and <clears throat> has this like attitude of uh, <coughs> where you're so convinced that what you're doing is the right thing so in this situation you need to be more tolerant and more understanding and you will see because the judgment will come you will see everyone will see who was in the wrong justice will be made the final judgment <laughs> um okay now about this person here what they're doing and how you're perceiving okay what they're doing and how you're perceiving Let's see. If they, you're perceiving that they have, you're pissed. You think that they have won something. You think that they have won the battle. You feel like they have gained something, and with this, that they, you feel wronged. With this three of cups, what they're doing, they're just doing. I think that they were, from what I see from this high priestess, like they are looking, they're doing what's in their best interest. <clears throat> they may have someone's help with these three of cups. <coughs> Someone has helped them in this um, issue here that you're fighting for or that there's this conflict about. And you're pissed that they're one. You're pissed, you're angry that they have... You perceive it as if they gained something from this. And that's why the this, this tension. But they're only doing what is in their best interest. But you're, you're being very judgmental in your attitude. And you're being a little bit short-sighted. And... You need to have more compassion and tolerance because in the end, justice will be served. How will be served? I don't know. Let's see. Okay. What will happen for them? What will happen for you? Let's see how this judgment <laughs> will happen for them. For, yeah. 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 It's clear. They will uh, feel, they will pay. They will pay, it will be very stressful for them. It will be, uh, this will be the fact that maybe they appeal to someone or that they, they have this. And this is temporary victory. This is not long-term victory for them. They have indeed gained something. They went for whatever it was, um, they thought it's in their interest. Oh, so they weren't thinking of others. They were thinking of themselves. They were doing only what was best for them. They had someone to help them. They gained this. But they will pay for this. And you, everything will flow. The Ace of Cups. Justice will be done. Uh, in, and for you, it will be good. It will be in, in your favor. So, yes, you were wronged, but still, you need to, um, don't let this make you bitter. Don't let this make you, I mean, yeah, it's it's good to want justice. It's good, uh, of course, <laughs> it's good to want justice. It's good to, like, stand up for yourself and protect yourself. But I feel like in this situation, you're a bit too, you're missing something. You're missing the point of something. 
and you are not acting very dignify yourself you're maybe I don't know there's this attitude like you're overly judgmental and overly something like this and um, you need to be more more tolerant and not just tolerant this is more about um, patient be also patient because the mother is patient and uh, <clears throat> Because you, you after this judgment come, you know now you're frustrated because what whatever has happened, they they want something, and you're feeling bitter and you're saying things and you're <clears throat> <clears throat> you know when we're angry we say all kind of things and after judgment will be served, you might feel sorry for what you've said or you might feel so, so don't make sure that you don't overdo it you don't overreact. You don't over... I mean, it's okay to want justice. It's okay to want things to be fair. Nothing to say about that. But be careful in how you act. Uh, be careful in... Don't let this turn you into a, a bitter and nasty person, you know? Like, be, be, be measured and be patient. Because, as I said, it will come and it will be in your favor. They will, they will have to answer for what they did. This is very... <laughs> the ten of wands very stressful energy very a lot of burden a lot of they, they will carry a lot of these heavy energies um, after the judgment comes so they will pay for what they did but don't let this situation turn you into a, a nasty person just be more patient and yeah, because later you might feel sorry for overreacting, maybe, or you might feel sorry for overdoing certain things. So yeah, this is what I what I get for you guys from this reading. Uh, if you resonated with this, I hope it helped. And if you didn't, then it's okay. As I said, I'm repeating myself. Maybe in my next video, I have a message for you. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you later. Bye bye, Libras.